Hi, besties. I kind of wanted to do a video on taking you guys along with me for my thrifting adventures because I have a method to my madness and it almost always works. Recently, I've been trying to shop a little more sustainably. I work at a corporate company that wastes shit all day long. All day long. Just a lot of shit. So I feel like... It is my human duty to undo that a little bit in every way I possibly can. Now, ironically, we're gonna start at Starbucks. I always need a coffee in my hand when I go thrifting. I don't know why. I don't know why. So I start with a coffee and then we will go from there. Hi, I was just gonna see if you guys could make me something that has coffee in it, is iced, and is kind of sweet. So you want like a surprise you Yeah. Hi, I'll have that for you. Awesome, thank you. Thank you. All right, I wanted to try it with you guys. I love doing this shit. It probably annoys them. I guess I don't know. Starbucks people, does it piss you off whenever people ask for random things? I just never know what I want. White mocha iced toffee nut syrup. So I start out the bags right at the entrance. Do I have a buy bag? No. Just like looking at them. That's a lie. This bag is from here. Okay, first of all, TJ Maxx hitting today. Hitting. You can tell within the first five minutes of walking into a TJ Maxx if it's gonna hit or not. But it's so busy in here, hiding in the clearance section. This lady came up to me literally while I was shopping and was like, you smell so good. And I was like, I work about the body work, so. <laughs> Stop everything right now, right now. At this point, I'm gonna need a cart. Cart rule. If I need a cart, I have too much stuff. But it's just too good. God damn it! They just get you every time! I'm gonna do a full haul of everything I get today when I get home. I know this wasn't really thrifting, but I usually just pregame here. This is just to get the caffeine running through my system. But they just had so much good shit! I really had to hold back and I still spent 60 bucks. I firmly believe that TJ Maxx is a little bit more sustainable than like other places. I think next we're gonna hit Plato's Closet. I'm not really even in the market for clothes right now. I'm not even really in the market for anything right now. Um, I like going to Goodwill to grab like little shit. My thing with going to Goodwills and like any of those stores, any of those like thrift stores is like, if it catches my eye, I buy it because it's probably a once in a lifetime opportunity. I retract my previous statement. I think we're just gonna go to Goodwill next. The good Goodwill. I wanted to show you guys a little bit of my process in here, but it's a Friday and it is so busy in there. Like busy, noisy, people everywhere. Hopefully Goodwill isn't as poppin'. I really wanna like talk you guys through my process and what I do. In TJ Maxx, I usually start at the bags, go to the makeup, go to the shoes, go to the clearance, go to the home stuff and then hit like any of like the clothing area. If something jumps out at me, I'll get it. I haven't been buying a lot of clothes recently for some reason, and if they are clothes, it's probably workout clothes. <laughs> I don't know what's gotten into me, but let's go. Because why do I kind of like them? Why do I kind of like them? We walk in. Go straight for the shoes. Check out these green pair Converse, but they're size eight, so I'm crying. And I go along the tops of the shelves, and I like to look for little knickknacks. Shit to put on top of my toilet or whatever. <laughs> Boo! That Goodwill fucking sucked! What I think that we'll do is hit the other Goodwill by my house, just to give it a shot. JK had a change of plans. Never been here before. This is like the most organized thrift store I've ever seen.
hey, you're coming home with me. about this jacket the whole time that I was walking around everybody was like that's a good find that's a really good find and I'm like <laughs> word so I'm gonna go home and then I'm gonna give you all a haul of what I got I wanted to hit one more Goodwill but I never find anything at that Goodwill so I don't know why today would be the day so I'm gonna head home we're gonna do a little try on haul all right guys granted TJ Maxx is not a thrift store however comma I did get some good shit there so it's a notable mention this shit though made today worth it. So I did strike out at my favorite Goodwill and I'm a little upset about that. I did post these really cool shoes that I found that just were not in my size on my Snapchat story and somebody bought them. So somebody won at that Goodwill today, okay? So we'll start out with what I got from TJ Maxx. I got this matching towel set because oh my fucking God, how cute is this? I got that bitch tattooed on my finger. Oh, oh my God. Keep them bad vibes out my fucking shower. This was only $6 for like this kind of half throw towel. And then for the full size towel, I think it was seven. So, and then I never buy clothes from TJ Maxx either. I always get shit from my apartment at TJ Maxx. But look at how cute this little top is. Hold on one second. Can you see my nipples through that? Look at how cute. Obsessed. $9, TJ Maxx. And then I'm going back to TJ Maxx literally as soon as I'm done filming this to exchange it for a bigger size because I don't know who thought that she was an extra small, but she's not. This workout top, goaded, goaded. If y'all are into like fitness or whatever, or if you work out or you want to get into it, TJ Maxx has the cutest like gym outfits ever. And then I got these matching biker shorts. And then look at how cute the little pink ones are. I love it. All right, guys, can I get a little commotion? for the jacket. Yeah! I found a jacket very similar to this at a thrift store and it was $75. And it was like this, but it was black suede. I wanted it so bad, couldn't afford it at the time. My boyfriend went back and tried to buy it for me. It was sold. I was devastated. I had a whole memorial for it. And then I went to this thrift store that I've never been to before, new favorite thrift store. And I found this for $25. And then with my military discount, it was 23. And the guy at the desk told me that this is actually a vintage Wilson's jacket. I found them on Poshmark being resold for $150. It's never coming off. I am genuinely so pleased with everything that I found today. Thanks for coming with me on my little shopping adventure. I hope that you had fun. I had fun. It was a good time. I am so hyped about that jacket. If you follow me on Instagram, then you probably already saw it on my Instagram story. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then go follow me on Instagram so you get sneak peeks into new videos before I post them. <laughs> but thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for coming shopping with me. Love you guys so much. See you in the next video.